there's a um, historical record of at least three dozen other people who are interred in that location. And the vast majority of them are U.S. soldiers who were living uh, on at Fort Jefferson. And then a new hospital, which is the one that we actually found, was built in the 1890s. And it was used by the U.S. Hospital Service to treat uh, quarantined sailors coming in off of foreign ships, yellow fever victims, that sort of thing. Above water, at least until the early part of the 20th century, and then there's been a lot of change at, on the site over time in terms of currents, a lot uh, more hurricanes kind of passing through the area. So it's just kind of worked to, to erode the site down over time. And so our goal with the National Park Service is to leave these sites preserved, unimpaired for the betterment of this and future generations.